good. And I, I pull it a little like that. Nice. Nice. Now I'm going to run over to the okay. sewing. And another thing you can do to make this lie really flat, if it's, if it's something you, you know, you don't want these gathers to poof up, you can run a little top stitch right along the top edge of this right here, right along the top. Mm -hmm. And it, it just makes everything makes it flat. flat. Mm -hmm. I'm going to run it over here and just iron it out. It's getting close, very close to the end of this class. So if you oh. have any other questions, be sure to type them or call to ask. But we have a lot more in store for tomorrow, right? Yeah. What are We're we going to do? We are going to um, sculpt the shoes. Mm -hmm. And uh, that will probably take... Sculpting the shoes will probably take the whole time. Mm-hmm. I'm thinking. So we still have to do the hat today. We could do the yes. hat today. Okay. If we don't have time to do the hat today. We could do it tomorrow. We can do it tomorrow. But um, how much time do we have left here? We have some time. Okay. Because we still have to. We're gonna we're gonna put this on our guy, mm -hmm. and uh, I'm not gonna. I don't think I'm gonna hem that because I do the, the salvage. Salvage. But we have you know this back part mm -hmm. that we could um, turn under. And if we leave it open, you want to somehow, um, well, finish finish the edge and turn it under, and then just t either top stitch it, but then we'll ladder stitch that. That's what I would do if mm -hmm. I was going to use this as a, let's put it on her and see how it looks. Him, I mean. <laughs> Sorry, curious Mondo. <laughs> We know you're a guy. <laughs> He's so patient. He is. <laughs> Talk about patient. There. Let's give a close up on this guy. I look like the missus. There's a basic dress. <laughs> <laughs> that is a basic dress. And you could shorten it. Uh, there's a lot of things you could do to to embellish, you could add a little apron. Um, the back, like I said, the back, I would, to finish this off, I would finish this edge either with an overlock on the machine or some Fabri-Tac, something that, that wouldn't fray, and then I would turn it under and top stitch it. Mm -hmm. And that would be good. And then? Because right here, we either gonna you could finish this by either putting folding this over and putting a row of buttons, mm -hmm. which would be really cute, or you could just ladder stitch it closed. Okay. So those are your finishing options, you, or you could put Velcro if you wanted this to come on and off. It was if it was a ball jointed. This is where you would you definitely would finish this edge because you want the stability. Mm -hmm. Anytime you pull something over and over again, you want it to be double. Yeah. Uh, double thickness but that's that that's it yeah that's great